Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, no much could depending on your location. Please join in the struggle to liberate our people from the contraption. Like and share videos. Today is Sunday, the 25th day of August 2024. Happy Sunday. I bring you this update. Tinubu government excludes Southeast students from the federal government loan scheme. Yes, that's what is happening now. According to the Nile Fonds Secular, Yes, over 2.9 billion naira has been allocated and distributed as loans for tuition fees to more than 27,000 students across 19 higher education institutions in Nigeria. 19, 19 higher education institutions in Nigeria. Now, bulletinable led government has excluded tertiary institutions and the site is from the initial list of the beneficiaries in the Nigerian Education Loan Fund. Yes, NEL Fund in short form. Yes, the disbursement. Yes, talking about um, the, the 2.9 billion Naira initial disbursement of the NEL Fund. Yes. Now, according to the circular from the NEL Funds, over 2.9 billion has been allocated and distributed as loans. Yes, in their first, in the in the first instance, or the first phase. Now, none of these institutions, talking about the 19 institutions, they distributed this money to. None of them, are, none of these institutions are located in the southeast. Well, at least one institution from each of other five geopolitical zones is included. Yes. Now, Nell Phone spokesperson Nasir Ayatogo, when he when was asked about the exclusion of the Southeast institutions from the list, he said that the distribution of funds was not influenced by geopolitical zones considerations. According to him, he said there is no consideration of geopolitical zones in this budget. However, he explained that the that only institutions which responded to Nelfon's verification list sent to eligible institutions nationwide have been included in the disbursement. According to this uh, Ayatogo, he said Nelfon sent a verification list to every eligible institution. Only those that responded are receiving funds. He said they have not yet received any responses. From institutions in the southeast, and he said the exclusion of the southeast region. Of course, uh, you know that the exclusion of the southeast region has fueled the ongoing criticisms of the APC government right from Tinubu, the Buhari's era. Yes, that we continue to neglect, exclude the southeast from the political and administrative matters in Nigeria. People are complaining and saying this is total you know, exclusion and it was intentional. But you have seen the response from the Nell Fund. Spokesperson said it was not intentional. But they have five geopolitical zones. They have the Northeast, the Northwest, the North Central institutions Represented. They have the South West and Nash Delta, the one they refer to as South South. So these ones that have been captured, only the South East. And you are telling us this is not saying you know, intentional, or it wasn't intentional rather. Okay? That it was just that the institutions in the South East, they failed to respond, you know? He said they failed to respond. They have not received any response from the institution the South East. They sent a verification list to every eligible institution. Say so those ones in the South East, they are yet to respond. So, but what is the point now? The point is that we don't need this nonsense loan from Tinubu regime. Simple. They don't need it. So it's better as the students are rejecting it, good and fine. The, the, the institutions in the South East, they are rejecting it good. Because the net phone said they are yet to receive responses from the institutions in the South East. We don't know the institutions they sent the verification list. 
They have not mentioned it. Yes. They didn't mention the institutions. They send this verification list in the south east. Even at that, we are saying. The point remains that Tindibu, they are not interested in Tindibu's uh, leper's gift. The gift to leper. Yes. Tindibu is gifting to lepers. Tindibu are not lepers. Let the lepers continue to collect the lepers' gift. Oh yes, that is leper. He is giving to lepers. That is lepers gifting to lepers. Yes, they were not leper. So the lepers let them collect. Let them collect. Oh yes. So that is the point. They were not hungry. They are not begging for crumbs from the table. So those who are ready to collect the crumbs from the table, they should go ahead and collect the crumbs. And the crumbs will not make them any different. Do not make them richer than Nebo. Do not make them more educated than Nebo. Do not make them more advanced than Nebo. Do not make them more civilized than Nebo. Yes, to only make them to remain under the, the suffocation of the evil governments. Successive evil governments in the contraption. Yes, those regions that have produced more government appointees, more presidents, and everything, they are the poorest of the poor in the country today. Yes, the more you have access to power, the more you have access to appointment, political appointment, administrative appointment in the country, in Nigeria, the more poor, the more hunger. Even insecurity ravages the region where you come from. That region that produces presidents, they you know, produce more appointments or political positions. They have more poor people. Yes, hunger ravaging them on the development. Okay? So it's not something that people will be weeping and crying and say, oh, we have been excluded. He said it here. Yeah. We are taking his words. He said, the institution from the side is refused. Good and fine. They refused to send list to them because they know that this is scam. Tinibu's uh, leper's gift. Nibu rejects Tinibu's leper's gift. Yes, he's gifting to lepers. We don't have lepers in the south east. That's simple. Nibu are no lepers. That is it. So let him go ahead and continue to share the leper's gift to lepers. That is it. So the, 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 the student's loan or no student's loan, and they are making progress. They are going to school. They are being educated. Oh, yes. The quota system they brought in, we know why. They said federal character. Federal character is because they are not going to school. The Northerners are not going to school. They want people, they want to meet up with others. In everything they say, for their character, for their character, quota system. Not by merit, it's just for their character, quota system. So that every region will bring their own. States will have, you know, equal representation. Because they know if, are, if it's been by, done by merit, they will not be there. By merit, they will not be there. Oh yes, so that's why they put the federal character to their constitution. And they call it quota system. Quota system. Yes, the the, the, the the schools in Nigeria, talk about the one they call unity schools. Unity schools. If you see the cutoff mark, see the cutoff mark of a unity school in Sokoto, and see the cutoff mark of a unity school in, the, in Anambra, they're not the same. The cut for Anambra students higher, say 200. Why they call for Sokoto students 80? Because they know that there are education disadvantaged states. They want them to meet up with others. Yet, they are still backward. Oh, yes. You see, tomorrow in Jamb, in Wayek, the schools in the south, they are still taking the lead. Oh, yes. So, it will not in any way affect the education of Ndebo.